All right, everybody. Uh, Paul Stetsowitz here with the Weeks Aircraft uh, with the Mechanics Corner doing an update on the P-35A. Uh, we got the engine off the project and the next step, of course, is to demate the fuselage from the center section and then get that fuselage into a rotisserie so we can easily work on it and then, of course, the, the center section at that point will be more accessible uh, to do tests and make sure everything is true and then uh, we'll go from there. Well, you could pick it off and just set it on sawhorses. Yeah. You could do that. We have, um... <clears throat> yeah. You get... How many more are you going to want? How wide across that is. Uh, uh, you probably it might be better to have like four. See if I can get four all the same one. I, you want the ratchet or the? Yeah. I need a socket on a no, I'm good for breaker now. bar. A breaker bar? Yeah. Okay. okay. Good. <laughs> I don't finger. need a wrench. Iron Man. Does it go on? Yeah. Good. I mean, it can fit on it, right? Get a tiny bit of weight on it. And then uh, knock the bolts through. Actually, we can do that now. Most of them are already already through. It's stationary in the airplane. That's the only thing up front that is a concern. Back here when we go up at this thing, these two drive shafts, that one, actually this one's on the edge. This one has to clear that floor. This one's still attached, but there's no bolt that holds it in there. It just slips over a fitting. So it, that should come off when we go up with it. This cable runs back to the tail wheel and to make sure it doesn't get snagged on anything on the way up. I think it's going to be okay. Pop right off. <laughs> pop sure right off. Find this last word. Man. By the fact that these bolts are It's very encouraging. I mean, that maybe that's thinner or something. We got him. We got moving up front. Yeah, yeah it's coming. Oh, oh yeah, it's pinched yeah. in there, huh? You want to block the water pump? Yeah. Want to go up with it a little bit longer? Yeah. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to force oh. it up. Oh, oh. Coming right up. Oh, oh, that's a lot. Can you make them posted. Yep. Oh, oh. We're still not. Uh, back here, we're still kind of in. Hey, hey, hold on. Hold on, what? No, I was telling him. Stop. Is that coming up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he does what he did there. Here, you're um, going. Yeah, yeah, the bottom one came out there. The shop's go through the floor. Let me go up with the tail. 
Two that are fastened to the wing that go up into the. Let me look. Sorry. That one. And this one. I need to clear the top. Well, let's break them free here too. Um, what is that? Seven sixteen. Seven We got yeah. two. It's break. It's uh. I think yeah, it's brake line is what it is. But let me break them free here, so they're Rob clear. Coming up with it. Okay. Thing looks good. Okay, you have. Um... Now we don't get snagged on anything that we're going up. We got to go up another. Yeah. 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 that way with the center section. Um, well, can you see how much this goes up yeah, here? Yeah, but if we get it all the way to here, mm -hmm. it should clear. All right, so let's come down a little bit and we'll just side load the center section to the, to the right. Cool. Go down, Dave. Okay. That's weird, the book said nothing about that. All right, hold it right there. Boxes on P17. Yeah, I know. That's cool, isn't it? Yeah. Sit on the bench. Yeah. I think that's it. I'll watch it as we go up again. Here. 
yards is wide enough to span that. Uh, they're going to be close. Let's go like that. That's a good day. Stop. This is a safety, just to balance it out a little bit, so something. Watch like coming through your head. How's that, Dave? I'd say perfect. I'm going to go that far. Better than perfect. I'm like you. It went pretty good, other than the fact that, the, you know, there was a list in the book of like 16 or 18 things that had to be disconnected. And I went through all that. And and there was a couple that weren't on the list that I saw, yeah. and then we went up with it. And then we went up and got hung up on the on the gear flat motor, and it was weird. The book never said anything about removing it, but it had to come off. But luckily, there was only like three bolts holding it, so we pulled it off, and that was the last one. So I'm very impressed by the way it come off, because there's like the fuselage is nice. All those bolts, the bolts they just pushed out by hand. So, which indicates that this thing was never really heavily damaged. This airplane was in a pretty bad uh, nose over, flip over when it was with the Swedish Air Force, and the, and the picture shows it to be pretty banged up, but I don't think it was bang, as banged up as it appears. I think it just went over on its nose was it, as it was braking, and it flipped and it broke the engine mount and the vertical fin. But I don't see any, any damage to the fuselage or the firewall or anything. So. Good, so now we got P35 stuff scattered all over the place. <laughs> Just a worm here the way it is. 
stop. Maybe it just needs some lubrication. You gotta push in on it. Turn as soon as you can and I'll swing. Wow. Oh, we'll clear. Pretty good. This can't stay here once we put the wing in the fixture, but we can certainly leave it here while we fit them to the center section out here in the... That's good. Yeah, you have a walkway there? Yeah. Okay. Alright everybody, we got the fuselage off of the center section and the fuselage is now in the rotisserie stand so we can easily work on that and the next step in the progress of this airplane is to uh, rebuild the outer wing panels. Um, those two pieces are going to go into fixture stands that we have made up and that's going to allow Rick to open up the wings, make all new skins, inspect their internal parts and hopefully clean it up and start making progress on the wings so stay tuned.